Hey, it's Jang here from Ultimate RC and RCmania.com, the place for toy grade RC reviews. This is the video to accompany my full written review of the New Bright Rock Crawler. This is the new 2011 version that's updated compared to the Jeep Rock Crawler that I tested back in 2006. It has basically the same four wheel drive chassis, but new wheels and tires, new springs, and a new body. Right from the start, the new springs did not impress me at all. They're so stiff that you hardly get any motion from any corner without picking up another tire. The soft springs were actually one of the few things that I actually liked on the 2006 version. This just doesn't feel right. They still include a 9.6 volt rechargeable nickel metal hydride battery pack and there's a wall charger to go with this and it has a pistol grip controller. Unfortunately the steering is just full left full right but you do have full proportional control of the throttle. This is also a four band controller so you can actually just flip a switch on it and on the vehicle and run up to four at once. This vehicle is slow. It's very 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 slow but it's supposed to be this is not a racing vehicle it is a rock crawler it's designed to crawl over really rough terrain it actually has enough power in its motors to go much 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 faster than this but it's geared down specifically to have a ton of torque so let's see it try to climb over a rock what Oh, uh, oh, uh -huh. <laughs> what do you know? It actually did it. How about something a little steeper? Yep, did that too. Well, I'm just going to be quiet and let you watch and uh, let the performance of the new bright rock crawler speak for itself. The new New Bright Rock Crawler is clearly a huge improvement over their previous models. For lots of specific information about this vehicle, including how much it costs, the charging time, other little details, and more of my thoughts about the vehicle in general, be sure to check out the full written review, which is online at rcmania.com. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you again soon.